The first criminal trial involving a former U.S. president began today in New York as former President Donald Trump's fate now lies in the hands of a jury. 7 News reporter Jake McGlumpy spoke with our legal analyst Diana Crutchfeld today and joins us live in the studio to share what the main takeaways were from the first day. Jake. Yes, yeah, Stephen, former President Donald Trump's hush money trial is officially underway as opening statements to the jury from both the prosecutor and Trump's legal team were made today. 7 News legal analyst Diana Crutchfield says the prosecutor began their opening statements with the argument that the payoff Trump made to Stormy Daniels was a criminal act because it gave him an advantage in the 2016 election. The defense attorneys argued that Trump is innocent and that the Manhattan District Attorney's Office should never have brought this case. She says after the opening statements, the prosecution called their first witness to the stand. That witness was David Pecker, who worked with Trump to allegedly pay off several people who were making allegations against him. They can establish, and if they establish, the prosecution that is, that the, that the payoff to Stormy Daniels was for the purpose of having an advantage or avoiding a disadvantage in the election, then that in and of itself is a crime. And, but he's not been charged with that. He's been charged with the cover-up of that after by falsifying records with Cohen. Crutchfield says the first thing to happen tomorrow morning will be a gag order violation hearing regarding recent posts that Trump has made regarding the trial. She says Pecker will also return to the witness stand tomorrow, and she is interested in how he will talk about the involvement of the allegations in regards to the election. Reporting live in the 7 News studio, I'm Jake McGlumphy, working for you.